Uh, I think if Kenner Morgan had come in a little bit more um, where they wanted to uh, be a little more compromising, if they had seemed to be a little bit more understanding, um, their message might have resonated more. I still think that all of the landowners would have probably been against it, but we at least may have been more open to hearing their message and maybe help them find a compromise. But, um, you know, we, we haven't found it. Uh, they do not, uh, they already have right away, Kendra Morgan does, from Savannah, Georgia, all the way to Hartwell, Georgia. Um, it goes, they already have an easement, a natural gas easement called the Elba Express. And you can put, and Kendra Morgan does have in other places, a gasoline pipeline in the same um, easement that they have a natural gas pipeline. But they, in several meetings I've attended, they refuse to discuss why they won't co-locate their two pipelines together. And so um, they're asking us to give up our private property, but they're not willing to use theirs. And so um, I, I don't understand that. Um, our family is a very hardworking family, a very frugal family. Um, we do things the, the simplest way, the way with the, you know, less amount of time and less amount of money spent. And it seems like to me, if they, they by law, they have to inspect, fly over and, and walk these easements a certain number of times a year. So it seems to me if you had um, your natural gas easement and your in your gasoline easement in the same piece of land, it would be it would be half the inspections and half the, the time. But again, that just goes to show there's such a big business that they're not looking at that.